they get to know the community in Battle Creek and some of the opportunities. Um, get to hang out and have fun and eat some food and uh, meet people. Yes. So I think that, that, that's kind of the intention of the event. Yeah. People feel more comfortable. <laughs> it's uh, very busy, but very fun. Uh, a lot of, uh, I've spent a lot of time solving last minute problems and things, so I don't get to spend a lot of time like participating. But it's been like it's fun. I mean, it's good to see people who are excited to be here, and I think that everybody's having a good time. So it's you know, I'm enjoying myself. I think it lets students know that. Uh, that we care about them, like that we don't, yeah. that we, we want them to participate, be active in their community, and to be active here on campus. Um, and I think that it just, it, it's a friendly vibe. I like mm -hmm. to think it's a friendly vibe. Yeah. Um, and I think that um, just letting students know that, like, we want them to, like, come and be students. You know, yeah. don't, it shouldn't just be uh, go to school, go to work, go home. Like, there's stuff here on campus for people to do, and there's lots yeah. of resources for them also. Well, it's very good. I've been to probably all of them. Maybe I missed one or two, but um, I enjoy coming out here and talking. I feel like when you're first entering college, or maybe you don't know your way around, and first mm -hmm. have opportunities to know what Battle Creek has to offer. Yeah, that's the know what the school has to offer. And different organizations offer different things based on your belief system, your values, what We always have a ton of fun and mm -hmm. meet lots of students. Um, I also like connecting with the other agencies and getting lots of free stuff. <laughs> when I saw that they were combining them this year, I thought that was a really great idea. Mm -hmm. um, so I think it seems I haven't been out here too long, but you know what? It's not bad. It's a little more for my taste, but all in all, it's a pretty good experience. No, just this is an event for you to talk to people that you don't really know, so I don't feel weird going up to someone and just saying, hey. Yeah. Well, to go off of that last one, there's plenty of clubs to join, which, if you can, I'd say go for it. Join one. It's just talking to different people. I was able to play some Mario Kart. Oh, really? Yes. It was fun. Oh, it gives them a little bit of experience. We don't have any doubts to what it has to offer. It, it allows them to um, interact with people from different departments and ask questions if they have them. I think they'll feel more comfortable trying things that they want to have before or just seeing things that are available here that they want to have known or here. Time for a club, but... It does fill me with confidence that there's plenty of cups I could join if I wanted to. How will the cornhole tournament? Mm -hmm. That just sounds awesome. That's true. Uh, also, um, shout out to the benefit concert going on November 30th. That's oh, always yeah. great for the performing arts. Mm -hmm. I think they'll have a much more positive outlook on KCC. They feel more engaged and they realize that we really are not. Second or third year, I have participated mm -hmm. personally. Yeah, um, I know Battle Creek Pride has done it for probably four years, I would say. Mm -hmm. um, so my experience this year versus last year, I feel like lots more people are stopping by the table. Mm -hmm. I feel like having trivia questions and a little bit more interactiveness um, has been a lot more fun. Yeah, and exciting. Mm -hmm. And having the volunteer aspect mm -hmm. tied into this has been really great. Yeah, of course. Um, how does this event make you feel? A few weeks, the things that you get involved in are going to continue for the rest of the semester. Um, we're not going to be able to capture students' attention once we get into midterms and finals yeah. and all of that stuff. Mm -hmm. So it's a really important time. Better. <laughs> <laughs> the weather's better. Um, I think they have a lot more activity going on this year. Yeah. There's a lot that more for students to come out and enjoy. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Engagement uh, fair. Uh -huh. So 
Um, if you're here, you can actually also get your stuff done for service learning if you go and talk to Kate and all of them. They've got mm -hmm. community partners who are there specifically for the Civic Engagement Fair. Yeah. And they've got other community partners that are here just to, you know, promote their brand or whatever else. Mm -hmm. um, the biggest difference is that we actually moved all of our student clubs and organizations into the Binda Theater. This is the first time we split indoor and outdoor things happening at the same yeah. time. Uh, which has been its own challenge. Mm -hmm. so. Um, because of all the different resources and different ways to get involved on campus, because we're allowing students to explore those things freely, um, I'm hoping the outcome, well, the outcome should be that students will have the resources that they need to be able to succeed throughout the school year yeah. and be able to, like, promote their own style or brand of leadership that they find uh, that works best for them. So, uh, there's, there's so many different options here that students don't get placed into a, a generic box about this is the only way you can do leadership activities. There's all kinds of things here that they can uh, get involved in. Uh, it's really just good seeing everyone out here. Like, that's about as simple as I can put it. Like, if you just pan around, there's a lot of people out here. I think it affects students. Um, it's exactly that. They have mm -hmm. gives them a voice, gives them a safe space. Um, again, there's something for everybody here, so depending on um, what they're looking for, they can find their niche and find their comfort space in every room they can hear somewhere. Mm -hmm.